everybody. I'm Sean. And I'm Steph. And welcome back to Sean and Steph IRL. We've got some updates for you. We have some updates. The very first thing that we want to say, though, before we start our updates, thank you to every yes. single one of you for watching you are our amazing. vlogs. Amazing. You are awesome. Um, thank you for subscribing. We are yeah. over 500 subscribers. Ooh. Ooh, we're so excited about that. Sorry, we missed the 500 mark. We're a little bit over that now, but yeah. we were really busy doing uh, editing and getting stuff back for work. But thank you so much for subscribing and watching and commenting and everything. Um, it's fun for us to get to relive the transatlantic with you because uh, we don't remember anything that happened. We just finished cutting what day eight. Couldn't yes. tell you what we. What, it, it's such a blur. Uh, we're crazy. right in the midst. If you're watching with us, we're right in the midst of our five C days in a row, and the madness slowly yeah. starts setting in. Don't get me wrong, we, we love and adore the uh, the sea life, but um, yeah, it gets to you when every single day you're springing forward. So It was so difficult. So I difficult. didn't realize how hard it was going to be. The, I think on the very first change, I'm like, this is so easy. This is so cool. Yeah. Yeah, no, it was yeah. not. <laughs> Your declarations of how easy this is became less and less as the oh trip goes gosh, by. Oh my gosh, it was so, so hard. We don't want to give any spoilers. If you haven't seen it, make sure to go to SeanAndStephIRL.com, which will take you right to our YouTube page, or SeanAndStephIRL.blog, which will take you to everything, including our daily vlogs yes. on the ship. Make sure to check out all of our cruise vlogs. Uh, this one in particular was probably the best cruise we've ever had. It was great because it was her birthday. We did lots of crazy things, uh, hung out with crew. I mean, it just it was all in all a fantastic trip. The monkeys are coming. They are coming. Yeah, we're not we're not there yet though. Spoiler okay. alert. So before we talk about any of our updates, so I do want to say this. We were stopped dozens, and I'm not joking, I'm not elaborating. A lot of people are like, oh, look at him talking for exaggeration. One person said hi, and he's like, no. No, everywhere we went, everywhere we went, somebody stopped us. We were we were goofing around, and Stephanie was mid-rant about how she doesn't like Frozen, and I look across <laughs> the atrium, and there's this woman going like this to me. And I'm like, great, do you not like vloggers? Do you hate our show? Do you not like Frozen like us? Do you us? not like Frozen like <laughs> us? What's happening? And you know, it turns out they're, they're fans of the show and they're awesome people. And we got to meet them and hang out with them. And we hung out a couple times. A couple it times. Was great. There have been so many people who came and said hi. So thank you to every single person who yes, stopped us. Thank you. Thank you even to the woman who grabbed Stephanie in, the, in Barcelona, which we will talk which about later. Which we talk about, spoiler alert. Which we will talk <laughs> about later. Thank you for attempting to talk to us. Just. For future reference, don't randomly grab a YouTuber from behind in a foreign land. That just... Especially on La Rambla. But you know what? You get to see Stephanie's ninja move. <laughs> so anyway, anyway, <laughs> back to what we're, we're talking about. Thank you so, Thank so, you much, so much, for much for Thank stopping you. us. Thank you for watching. This channel is just a passion project for us, and we absolutely love, uh, love the response we're getting. Which brings us up to a lot of things, actually. A lot actually. of updates. So, very first update, MSC. We will be on the Ooh. MSC Seaside at the end of May. I think it's May, May 26th. 26. Mm -hmm. If you're going to be on that ship, definitely comment in the back oh, or yeah. in the bottom. It would be great to meet you guys on the ship. Um, if, and you, if you see us on the ship, say hi. Yes, yeah, say hi. We're not hi. scary. We, we noticed a couple people kind of lurking in the corner. Um, if you're just... See, we're not going to stop you if we see you just hanging out in the corner because we're not sure if you're actually trying to talk to us. With my luck, it'd be the person standing behind me and I'd make a big fool. But it's like, oh, hey, uh, you like the show? And he's like, what are you talking about? What show? <laughs> I'm, ta I'm looking at this person behind you, jerk. I'm like, oh, great. So we, won't, we don't necessarily approach people, but we're absolutely approachable. So if you're hanging out in the corner and you just want to say hi, you are never bothering us. I can't tell you how many people came up while Stephanie was shooting going, oh, are, are, are we bothering her? No. You're not bothering Stephanie. Stop us and say hi. Yeah. Also, if you have any tips or tricks, please um, leave them in the comments below. For MSC. Anything that we want to mm -hmm. see for the seaside. Mm -hmm. So that's the first update. More of like a, just kind of like a, a remembering reminder, reminder that yep. we will be on the seaside at the on end the of May. But you know what happens before the seaside? Guess what we're doing in two weeks. We not will even, be yeah. on almost a little less than two weeks, like 12 days or something. Uh, we will be on Royal Caribbean's Allure of the Seas. We are so excited. Uh, it was just a last minute thing that just happened to come across us and we are going. So um, we're really excited. I think we're going to be in an inside stateroom, yeah. and which we're really happy about. Um, and so we're going to see everything on the Allure. Everything. It is going to be the largest ship we've ever been on. I mean, there's things that I, I'm looking forward to. The neighborhoods, uh, oh, yes. like I can't wait. I can't Central believe Park. there are neighborhoborhoods on a cruise ship. Central That's Park. just. Pfft. I mean, just <laughs> crazy. It's basically a floating theme park. It's basically really. a floating theme park. So all of the stuff that all of the shows, they have Mamma Mia on board. I'm so excited about it's Mamma be Mia. Awesome. They have an ice skating rink. They have water shows. I mean, what don't they have is kind of going to probably be the theme of the vlog that we do. But we're going to bring you that all seven days. Um, we have new ports that we're going to that we've never been to we're before. We're going to uh, San Juan. 
uh, which we've never been to before. No, and uh, we're going to St. Martin, which we have been to, but, it's been a but long, we've never long vlogged time. it. So never now we get it. to show you, mm -hmm. and we have a cool tour that we're doing that we're hoping to do on in St. Martin. So that's coming up uh, May 13th. Yes, we so if you're on the May 13th leaving. sailing of the lure, say something. Come see us. Also, if you've been on a lure of the seas, let us know what's going on. We haven't been on a royal ship in over four years, and the largest ship we've ever been on on the Royal Caribbean side of things is Liberty, which is not anywhere near the size of a lure. Um, we just, we've not done Royal. We've always wanted to do a big ship and we're going to do another big ship with Royal later this year. But this one just fell in our laps. Literally, we got home from the transatlantic. This came around. We're like, yeah, let's do it. We've always wanted to explore. It's going to be dramatically different than uh, what yes. we typically do on the Norwegian ships. So we're really looking forward to comparing and contrasting and just having a, a just a, a ton of fun. Just all the fun. Like mm -hmm. seriously, all the fun on Royal Caribbean. And another update that we're hoping what? another things, update another update it's still in the works not 100 percent finalized oh, but it's, it's like 99.99 pretty 99. sure it's, it's finalized it's gonna happen we will be on the carnival horizon mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. september mm -hmm. um yeah. i think that's sailing september 22nd mm -hmm. it's a southern deep southern caribbean cruise deep south. Dirty so south. it'll be all new 100 new ports so that's yep. exciting um we'll bring you all that stuff so right now uh we definitely have allure mm -hmm. may 13th and then we are the going seaside. on the seaside may 26th so super busy cruising for us and that's that's the official locked down stuff yes. i wish we could show you steph's magic spreadsheet that has literally between now and december 31st of this year nothing less than a dozen more trips we're crossing our fingers so yeah but everything Ho works out hopefully we can pull it off hopefully we can make it happen and then uh, vlog every single day for you yes. um we're, we're just excited to do um a completely different style of cruise really looking forward to it so yeah like so if you've been on the seaside uh which may or may not be likely because it's a relatively new ship uh, let us know or uh, don't let us know what you've heard only let us yes. know uh, if, you, if you've yeah, been on it if you've been on it we don't like we, we don't want to hear rumors. we're gonna we're gonna we're here to squash yeah. some of these rumors <laughs> because it, some of them just don't make any sense yeah. um and then uh if you've been on the allure which has been around for a long time okay. it's even been to dry dock they've made some changes let us know what you think uh it looks like a stunning ship it looks beautiful i, I just i probably just hang out in central park all day and be like hey steph text me it when, when you're ready to birds. shoot something yeah like birds are in a living, living wall and i mean it's crazy it's like it's just crazy i can't even imagine trees and things growing on a I cruise ship. I also can't imagine 6,000 plus people on a ship, so. Yes, this will be a very large, <laughs> large boat for us. We The largest we've been on is Probably the, the Epic, Epic, yeah. and I think it holds 4,200, 40, something. I don't 4, know. 4,000 and change. Don't quote me on that, because yeah. I don't know, but it's like 4,000. Under 4,500 4, for sure. Which we think is a lot. Yeah. That's a lot, but 6,000 people yeah, at max capacity people. is crazy. Ooh. So we're so excited. Cannot I cannot wait. wait. Cannot wait. Uh, May 13th is coming yeah. up so fast. I basically have to do laundry now and get ready and get all of our stuff done for work and then get back on the cruise ships. We have to buy clothes too. We haven't had to buy oh, yeah, clothes before, which right. is weird. We, we don't, one of the many reasons we've always sailed with Norwegian is even on their most formal nights, it's super casual, yes. super informal. There are, don't get me wrong, there are people who, who dress up in full garb and that's fantastic, but there's no judgment and there's no, um, there's no anything. You can, you, right next to the person in a prom dress, you see it wearing short shorts. It's just how it, that was me too, by the way. Um, He's in the short shorts. Right. Yeah. No, we're we're actually I'm really excited to we like to embrace the culture of the ship that we're going on. So For sure. we the, I know that on ours we'll be on a seven day sailing, so we have two formal nights. Mm -hmm. So we are going to get two formal outfits, and I can't wait to do it. I mean, it'll be our first be time we dress up, it'll be fun, suit and tie, uh, I formal do not know dress. How to wear, I have not worn a tie. I don't, I don't think ever. I can't. remember. I think I have to Google how to make a tie. Thing, Not like. make a tie, tie a tie. <laughs> tie, a tie. <laughs> but knowing stuff, she'll make it first and then teach me how to tie it. So I have to Google how to do that and watch some YouTube videos on how to actually do a tie because yeah. we have no idea. But I've we're excited. We're so excited. So it'll be fun. So this is going to be like a crazy busy summer for us. But starting off with just a wild May, which is cool because uh, for my birthday we'll be on Allure and then we'll be right on uh, the seaside right afterwards. So very cool stuff. And then shortly thereafter we'll be on the carnival. With other things, uh, you know, sprinkled in between that we can't talk about. But wow, once they become even closer to being finalized, we cannot wait to share with you the stuff that's going on. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm. Let's just say everything from the sleepiest cruises to the craziest cruises we've got on lock. That's all I can say about that. Cannot wait. We're so excited. By the way, I got to get back to editing the show. So that's right. So thank you guys. Thank you again thank for you all so of your much. comments and your views and your subs. Well, um, amazing. You are Truly. amazing. Uh, we 
Yeah, your, your emails, you know, your comments, they, they, yeah. light up, they light up our life. Seriously, um, you know, it's so great to have people tell you wonderful things. Uh, we try to put positivity out there. That's just what we do. We're positive travel bloggers. You know, everyone's got problems. We try to put positivity out there. And when you get positivity back, that's a wonderful, wonderful thing. So yeah. thank you for your kind words, both publicly and privately. You all are, you are all amazing. And uh, we hope to run into you all on the ships. And if you've seen us before, leave a comment. If you've done any of these ships, the seaside or the, the, the horizon or the, uh, Allure. the Allure, let us know. I wish I could ask about these other ships, but can't talk about that quite yet. But uh, yeah. We'll do another update. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, thanks guys. We heart you, like major heart you. The mucho is. Um, and uh, yeah, so that's all. IRL update right now. Uh, we got to get back to work because we have a lot to do. So much work. So, and oh, we're on, we're halfway through our transatlantic, halfway. So yes, yeah, so again, if you haven't seen our transatlantic trip, it's our longest daily vlog, cruise vlog. It's going to be like 16 or 17 days when it's all said and done. I just wrapped day eight. I don't know what episode is actually live. We should probably know that. It's probably day six or day seven yeah. that's live. But uh, we're in production on day nine right now. So I think we're still at sea. <laughs> yeah, we have another sea day. But we're close. <gasps> we're close to getting to Madeira, mm -hmm. uh, to Funchal. So uh, <laughs> we are close. So yes, thank you guys for watching. You're thank you for awesome. subscribing. We love each and every one of you. Seriously, we truly love each and every one of you. You're all fantastic people. Uh -huh. And we'll see you on May 13th on Ooh, the Allure, Allure of the Seas. Seas. Cannot wait. Bye. Later. Bye.